All right, this is a continuation. <laughs> we emphasize it on you gays. I mean, so what? No, we, we got to do our question first. <laughs> Would you date someone with a disease? Girl. It's, no, no. That's a it, tough one. After a long period of relationship. And like, yeah, I did you find out? But you know what? Like y'all, we just jumping from topic to topic. Like we do have to finish on what we were saying about Wait, the Wait, start over. We did. Finish. No, 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 no. Like that, we do that. We did finish. We were talking about y'all was talking about this why they feel like you know what I'm saying. And we told y'all bitches that if that's what they want to do, that's what they're gonna do. All right. Well, next topic. Moving on. Okay. Yeah, so I got your back. Sexual disease. Well. All of those damn diseases. What kind of there. disease are you talking about? But no, 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 wait, 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 wait. Let me just say something. Before we even get to would you date, half of the people out here are sleeping with bitches with, with diseases, diseases and not even and don't even know. Mm-hmm. So you can't really say would you, would you date. Okay, now if the person actually told you this is what a, this is my status. And y'all I mean, was talking and they, they showed you in. Okay, now are you talking about before or after y'all had sex? No, like y'all was talking. Y'all, no, y'all didn't have sex yet. Y'all just talking and then like, okay, you know you what? Guys. Let's put it this way. I'm not gonna lie. Before, if we had sex, before we had sex and they said this, I mean, I don't know. It, it it depends on how strongly I like you. You get what I'm saying? Because I don't know what your intentions are. Some people are real cruddy out here. They trying to like fuck you up because they fucked mm-hmm. up. Now, if we don't have sex a billion times, bitch. And now you telling me you oh I got the cookie the kitty <laughs> motherfucking turtle whatever <laughs> you gonna be walking slow soon or nothing like that or you know what I'm saying what could I do what the fuck I'm gonna do run and kill myself or you still like me you on the date I mean we done had sex ten twenty times why the fuck not right. I personally believe if you out front with it it should be no problem, it should be, it should be no problem. honestly like you should be practicing. Safe sex. sex anyway. Yeah, right. You just true. Stop right. being nasty to people without condoms. But then again, there's some diseases where you can even get it from kissing someone. Herpes. Mm-hmm. Genital warts. Oh no, I don't. I don't fuck with no herpes, uh-huh. bitch. That shit gonna show up on my face. Honey. Hello, what's in the mouth? I wanna fuck you up. All that breaking out. I'm I wanna fuck so, you up. I don't take it. It's bad so, now, did you have bitch, something? Would y'all really, would y'all really date someone with a disease? Like I said, I, if, if I was like, with somebody like I just said, time. like I would, but it has I mean, to be. You gotta respect them as a person because they said something. Yeah, yeah. I, that's that's the utmost respect I would give them. But like I said, I have to worry about me first. I'm not being selfish, but it has to be a strong liking. No bond. shade, I'll be scared. Of course, and I'm gonna. Build an extra, like a, a strong ass condom for you. You get a strong condom. <laughs> you know what? Like that's ignorant. Y'all being shady, that's right. Neil. That's ignorant, girl. Go sit your dress down. Like, we trying to be serious for real. Go sit your dress right, down. Right, right, right. Like, it has to be a strong, like, in bond. Like, your personality connection. has to, that connection has to be, like, can I, um, I don't know. Can I bring up a question? Can I bring up a question? Sure. Confession. Wait, I've done it. I've done it. After this video, we can talk about who. Um, can I bring up a question? Sure. Okay, okay, listen. And so, I mean, you gotta, you really, really have to be it's, careful. It's a lot of things be that goes involved with that. You gotta be careful. You gotta always be safe, safe sex. Make sure the condom is always on the snow shade. And I mean, how about and make sure they don't put holes in it? You, oh, yeah. Wait, I'm I feeling mean, it on I, you. I'm gonna bring up a question. <laughs> okay, say if you were with, okay, you know, gay relationships don't usually last that long, but a lot of them do. It's no shit. A lot of them do. So say if you were with a person for about two, two, two or three years, maybe even one year, and you find yourself you love this person, and they mess around on you, and they go out and they get HIV, they come back to you first and say, "Well, I have HIV." What, like, what would you do? First of all, hold up, wait. <laughs> if you went out and fucked around on me, fuck you. Bye. <laughs> You take you and your I and fucking know. Well, how do you feel? Well, 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 even if you gave it to somebody, or, I mean, if you gave it to that person or whatever, bye. <laughs> what are you trying to say, this, sweetie? Nobody and <laughs> me don't have that. So. Hey, bro, you talking about sleeping around. What do you think? I ain't going to put your teeth out there, but what if Wish McCall had found out about that? How do you think he would feel? Okay, we're about to stop this video. <laughs> we're, about <laughs> we're about to stop this video. We're we had stop. dirty laundry. I hadn't aired my. Okay. Life. So we are okay. Let's not gonna go there. We're not gonna go there. Let's see if we're gonna stop. Why would she say? Why would you say that with a motherfucking? Stop. But I'm gonna fight. This is the view.
She may because now her business is coming. And I'm Bob Walters. First of all, next topic. I don't have no business. Whatever I do, I'm a grown ass man. Okay. Well, Crashers. Let's talk about the ladies. Okay, for you late ass bitches. Who can't know wait, 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 wait. Oh, why? So, you, so wait, wait, you bitches. Why use you your own money? No, no, no. Why, How about that? Why can't you dumbass girls do the same thing we do? It's not hard, bitch. Get a fucking job. Stop stealing people cars because you ain't gonna do them to get locked. You will cause yourself to get locked and stealing clothes. This is crafting. It's really not. Don't believe her. No, it really. The only person she crafted it from was T Mobile. No. T Mobile. It's really crafted. This is a crafted sailor phone. He didn't craft it. Someone crafted it for him. Yeah, but see, but crafty girls need to be careful with this. I am doing. Some of you think it's really cute. You'll brag about it. Like, oh yeah, I just stole this. I stole that. I got this. Be careful who you said around. You'll cookie, still, cookie, you'll cookie. steal my whole outfit. And she for it back credit. Here. Sure. I mean, but no. I just honestly think. I mean, they're lazy. If I can get up and I can work I have a job. hour shift mm-hmm. five days a week, you can, then do, you it can too. do the same thing. I am a fucking working student. I'm and prostitution doesn't count. Money. If you're a prostitute, that don't count either. That's a job. That's not working. You that's make money, but it don't count as a job. It's a hustle. It's a hustle. No shit, it's a hustle. It's not a job. It's not a hustle. Either you're making under the table. Under the table. Is it illegal? You can't file under the taxes. The it's not legal. In a pizza place, they pay you under the table. So basically, you can't file for taxes if you work at a pizza place. You know so why? No, no, no. Let's put it this way. I'm not knocking nobody hustle how they make Literally. money. I'm not either. either. I'm just saying. It's but not, it's I mean, not, not at the same time, I'm not knocking your hustle. But like we talking about crafting like that is dangerous. Mm. That shit is late. It's like, dangerous and it's shady because like, you're you really shouldn't do it. Exactly. But like he said, a pizza shop. This is completely different. We said we said selling your body you're working at a pizza shop that's Hello. completely different from selling your body i don't think selling drugs is considered a job i don't think selling your body is considered a job i don't think crafting phones and selling them to people are is considered a job store credit is not a job because you cannot file for taxes at the end of the day if you're working at a pizza shop and you're getting your money and you're doing your hours at that pizza shop then yeah you're working a job mm-hmm. But if you're standing on a corner selling crack and coke and whatever that is and that your ass and all that other good stuff, <laughs> that's not a thing. How about this? <laughs> okay, I know. I mean, I don't really fuck with too many drag queens like that or drag kings or dragons. <laughs> I have one fucking thing but to no. say. No, 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 no. Let me just finish this. Because this is something real important that I think y'all all going to say, okay, you're right. Now, it's okay if you don't have a job and you know your director and it's not like really fortunate for you to get a job it's not easy sometimes because people really do look at you and say no you're the stereotype huh but okay one thing selling your ass for free is an issue with me and i noticed a lot of drag queens do that just for the cuteness of a guy or because they just want sex but like i mean if you're gonna do this and you're not doing nothing with yourself get get the fucking money <laughs> bitch you calling these motherfuckers say love love i'm giving you something you gotta give me some so by the fucking line yourself. not selling yourself but it's you know not. it's because if i call if i do it to my nigga and i want some money you better give me some money yeah, i mean but i'm really like right with that like you can't but you, most of them is not uh, you don't talk to this guy on a regular basis. Yeah. You just have you met him on the internet you randomly. You're not getting him anything out of. And it's no shade to nobody. This is just a lot of. I know a lot of people who do that. That's key, right? Uh, this is a lot of people who really do do that. Like, and you shouldn't do that because you're not doing something but putting yourself like in danger. In danger. But I mean, it's something that go on every day that I see. Trust me. Okay. I see. You've been feeling it in all four of these videos. <laughs> it don't matter. It's my mouth. Mm. This is your show. You know what? This is the gay view. Fuck it. That's the name of my new mother. The Carlo Shop. Okay. The, the Carlo Shop. Gay view show. The Carlo Shop. Okay. With the girl with the dress. Well, I'm going to know. I'm gonna, I'm, I really, I really, wanna, I really still want to talk about these Philadelphia gays. I'm just so. I think I'm over with y'all and y'all should leave. Oh no! Let's talk about the famous Philadelphia. No, no, wait. 
It's a continuation of this. Famous. They're 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 fam